Microsoft has released new preview update for Windows 10, version 22H2, brings several noteworthy changes to enhance the system's performance and address specific issues. One of the key fixes involves addressing a printer installation issue where some single-function printers were incorrectly installing as scanners. This update ensures a proper and accurate installation process for printers. Also Microsoft noted, the coming weeks will bring a richer weather experience to Windows 10 lock screen, this includes dynamic, interactive weather updates. This update also fixes a caching problem within the Windows Management Instrumentation WMI, system. This issue caused the current time zone to display incorrect values. The fix rectifies the caching issue, ensuring that the time zone representation is accurate. For users employing BitLocker data-only encryption with mobile device management MDM, services like Microsoft Intune, the update addresses potential data retrieval issues. Specifically, problems arising from the use of fixed drives encryption type or system drives encryption type policy settings in the BitLocker Configuration Service Provider CSP, node are resolved. Issues related to remote desktop sessions are also tackled. Users were experiencing difficulties reconnecting to existing sessions, leading to the creation of new ones. The update ensures a smooth reconnection process to existing remote desktop sessions. Furthermore, the update fixes a scenario where changing the keyboard language failed to apply to remote APPs. This improvement ensures that changes in keyboard language settings are successfully applied in such scenarios. Local Administrator Password Solution LAPS, Post Authentication Actions PA, are addressed in this update. Previously, these actions occurred at restart instead of at the end of the grace period, and the fix adjusts the timing to ensure proper execution. Other fixes include resolving IPv6 bind request failures in Active Directory, ensuring the processing of group memberships in the local users and groups CSP, and addressing issues with the removal of deleted cloud files. Additionally, problems with MSIX applications not opening and causing host unresponsiveness in specific scenarios are rectified to provide a smoother user experience. Overall, these updates aim to improve system functionality and address specific user-reported issues. In addition this update still have some known issues, Windows devices with more than one monitor may encounter difficulties with desktop icons. These issues include unexpected movement of icons between monitors and other alignment problems. Copilot in Windows, in preview, is currently not fully supported when the taskbar is vertically positioned on the right or left side of the screen. 